Hey folks, Positive Paul on a Thursday, April 25th, 2019. Figure I'd lighten the mood a little bit. Uh, out of all the books I have, I've, I've had this sitting on the shelf for a long time. I haven't really read it, I just perused through it. But a very interesting uh, concept, trying to figure out what happened to our Heavenly Father's Son before he had started his ministry and had you know the apostles join in everything he had done you know after that we we, we certainly know through the gospels of mark john luke matthew uh certainly paul but what what do we know what what was he doing before all this was he sitting in a carpenter shop uh no one really knows and and that that's the interesting part now in this book, uh, it was written in 1984. Uh, interestingly enough, the author's name is Elizabeth Clare Prophet, and she cites a, uh, a Russian uh, gentleman by the name of Nicholas Novovich, where after the Russo-Turkish uh, Wars around, say, maybe 1877, I believe, he had went on an epic journey uh, into India where he spent time with these Buddhist uh, monks uh, his journey took him uh, in through uh, uh, Afghanistan up into the Himalayas into Tibet where he ended up at a place called Molbek, which means a solitary place. It was a monastery and he had spent a lot of time with these yogis and uh, lamas. But while at Molbek, he had uh, discovered these tra transcripts that apparently cite a Saint Isa that had arrived there uh, nearly 1800 years prior and uh, they believe that this is our Heavenly Father's Son. Now of course a lot of this is all speculation but you know if you can find this book The Lost Years of Jesus I, I think it'd be worth a read. I just have so many other books I'm trying to go through uh, not to mention the Bible but uh, anyway, I thought I'd throw that out there for you all. I hope uh, your weekend's going to be a good one. And uh, God bless you all.